if all you had to offer was friendship, like who would still be around? Real situations expose fake people, so sometimes it takes getting down on life to find who's really down. You see, people pretend well when their souls are for sale. And sometimes it's the ones you love the most that mostly want to see you fail, that's real. Just because they riding with you doesn't mean they riding for you, that's facts. You see, loyalty shouldn't depend on your presence, it's more about how they act behind your back. Who can you trust? I mean, some of us are fighting for people that wouldn't throw a punch for us, and yet, these are the ones we call friends. You know, the ones that care so much about your struggle, but yet so silent when you win. The ones that bring gossip to you about you, but your name, they never defend. Understand, everybody in your boat might not be rowing, but drilling holes. And as time goes and that jealousy grows, pay attention, because that's when true motives get exposed. Everybody in your circle might not be in your corner. Support doesn't always come from familiar faces. So don't be surprised if God places strangers in your life to take you to higher places. Don't be surprised if your growth makes your circle smaller. But you got two choices. Let it break you or let it make you. Make your dream even larger. Make your vision seek farther. There's more to your path than where you're currently at. And I think life will teach you this. Sometimes the best way to add to your life is not to add to it, but to subtract. Understand, it's not about the size of your circle. It's about the loyalty that's in it. You see, nothing can stop a squad that's dedicated to fighting for the same mission, focused on the same vision. Does your circle got that type of commitment? Are they happy for you when you win it? Or is it the more you do better, the more their love gets distant? The more their support goes missing? Listen, real friends don't hate on each other. What they do is they push each other to go get it. In your life, do you got those type of friendships? Because mindsets are very contagious. And I promise you this, Whoever you consistently surround your life around will surely persuade it. Wake up, everybody's prayers for you ain't to make it. So do they really got love for you or do they just fake it? Do they really got love for you or do they just love to use you? To some you're just an opportunity, yeah. That's how these fake friends will do you. They present what you want just to take what they need. And when they can no longer benefit from your life, well, that's when their loyalty leaves. So I'm gonna ask you this question again. If all you had to offer was friendship, who would you still be able to call your friend? Hey, what's up, Rehabs Across the World, Trent here. Thanks for watching our new video. I hope it impacted your life. Listen, we're impacting lives all across the world. I want you to know this. It's because of you. It's because of you supporting the messages and sharing the messages. And speaking about sharing the messages, if this video touched your heart, if it's on your heart, please press share because I promise you this, there's somebody in the world right now that needs to watch this video. And by you pressing share, you become a hero in their life. I get messages every single day say, Trent, I had no idea what rehab time was yesterday, but my friend shared the video, I saw it on the timeline, and man, did I need it. We're gonna continue to impact the world only with your help. We appreciate you. But like I said in every single video, it all starts with you. It's rehab time. Let's get it.